Hi everyone, Ken from Orion Telescopes and Binoculars, and I wanted to show you the Orion Planetary Observing Guide Kit. This is a, a three guide kit that we put together, uh, obviously Saturn, Jupiter, and Mars, and it lists all sorts of useful information from uh, the details on observing specific features of each planet to uh, uh, conjunctions and uh, oppositions of each planet, as well as a host of other things. So let's go through each uh, guide and I'll show you what it, uh, what it has for you. So the Mars guide shows you everything you wanted to know about Mars here. On the inside, the first page, you've got all the identified features, the mountain ranges, some of the larger uh, features that you can see from a telescope. Summer, winter seasons, what uh, faces are gonna be showing, the, the, what you can identify in the telescope sometimes, the uh, polar ice cap. So here's the summer and the winter caps. If you go on the right side, then all of the features are labeled. And then down at the bottom here, you've got tips on observing it, either the surface or the uh, cloud structure above the surface. And then on the back here, we've got information about filters. So the RGB, the, the full color image, and then what each color filter shows, either photographically or visually. And down on the bottom here, you've got recommended filters for different features and uh, a list of the items that you can identify with it. And then finally on the back, We've got information about conjunctions and oppositions here, when uh, each one of those is going to be. But down on the bottom, a nice size reference to give you an idea of how big Mars is compared to the Earth and the Moon. So again, everything you wanted to know about Mars, observing it and uh, photographing it. Here we have the guide for Jupiter, and when you open this one up, you have a nice large picture identifying all of the cloud band structures what each cloud band is designated. There's a name for each one, believe it or not, and there's at least 15 of them designated here. Um, on the left side, well, my left side, your right, this is the uh, recommended filters for visual and for photographic use. And you can see we even have some methane and UV filters to show you what, uh, what glows best in each of those wavelengths. Uh, down on the bottom, the recommended visual observing filters and what uh, is best for each one. And down, again, at the very bottom, that's the recommended imaging filters. And then on the back side here, we've got the moons, observing the moons, tips for, for viewing them, identifying each one. And then rare events like double shadow transits or triple transit, uh, a list of a bunch of them going through 2020. And then on the back side, you've got a list of the opposition and conjunctions. And then what I like down here on the bottom is a good representative scale to how big Jupiter is compared to its moons and uh, Earth and our moon. All right, well, there you have it. This is the Orion Jupiter Observing Guide. All right, and lastly, this is the Saturn Observing Guide. And when you open this one up, a nice full color image of Saturn identifying the ring structures and some of the uh, surface features as well, the cloud bands. Uh, on the right side here, you have uh, suggested filters, both for observing and for imaging and a list of what uh, details come out with each filter, as well as down here, the uh, photographic filters as well. On the back side, you've got the Saturn's rings and then the tilt cycle, so you can tell exactly where uh, Saturn is in its tilt against the Earth. So sometimes Saturn is exactly edge on, you don't see any rings. Other times it's nice and uh, wide open. And then observing the moons around Saturn here. And then on the back, the opposition and conjunctions, uh, interesting uh, dates for some of those features and then relative scale and you can see earth compared to the ring is very very small so a nice relative scale of all the moons our, uh, our moon and earth as well all right and there you have it that is the orion saturn guide all right well there you have it, the orion planetary observing kit uh, it basically includes all the details you'd need to observe uh, mars jupiter and saturn all right well thank you very much clear skies